Okay, I wanted to put out, I, I realized that the video never did work on YouTube. We uploaded our free pick, DCTH, um, the video talking about uh, the triggers and the stops and everything else, but um, I realized it, it never, it just kept saying uploading or uploaded processing, please wait, and, then, and now it's like a day and a half later, and uh, it still says that, I believe. I haven't checked it in a while, so uh, our apologies. We'll try to send out another free pick this week. Uh, we'll just say DCTH doesn't count, but still going to follow up and show you what we were looking at. A nice big two-day volume pop here up to uh, 929 and really a sideways move up until yesterday uh, it popped to 919 so we were going to call it at 920 with a 930 add okay because that's breakout territory unfortunately it gapped up and so it ended up opening at uh, 940 and then I'll switch to fives and show you where I called it didn't have any kind of great entry on it but for our chat room today I uh, did call this at 9 59 had two equal tops here at 958 for the first 10 minutes. These are five minute candles So I said 959 could get it going worst case stop um, You know 934 below the previous candle, but uh, it didn't really much matter because five minutes later it was 975 and We go to a break-even stop and sell into this pop and it did make it all the way pretty quickly to 995 So even from 955 to 995, that's a nice move uh, in about 15 or 20 minutes uh, and you know what? This thing held up all day pretty well. This I was telling in the chat room, this could be multi-day. I'm not much of a swing trader, so I'm all out now. But I did have a nice trade in DCTH. Um, but it could be multi-day. The market was very weak this afternoon, so that, that didn't help DCTH at all. Um, as far as that goes, MON is really the only other highlight worth showing from today. Uh, it met uh, parameters of a new strategy we are employing in our chat room. Um, and the way we teach to play this one, the entry was over this little tight base here. As it, it was, it kept hitting 63 and pushing back down. So I called it if it broke 63, 6301 right here. Uh, worst case stop 6280, I believe, or 79. I'm not, you know, it was like 20 or 21 cents risk. Um, and really, pretty quickly, 6301. About 15 minutes later, all the way to 6399. So almost a dollar move in 15 minutes on a worst case 20 cent stop. And you know, you could say, well, it rolled over here at the end of the day. It doesn't matter because whenever we get the breakout or the pop we're looking for, we start selling into strength and get to a break even stop. So Monsanto, really the only other highlight of the day. We had some others that we played, um, you know, on some of these on some of these pushes down. Uh, British Petroleum BP, for example, 43.31. 10 minutes later, went to 43.45, but just couldn't hold on. So you know, selling some and break even stop. We had a lot of that stuff today. Uh, you know, a lot of small stuff because the market, as you can see, just really, really weak. Uh, also, same thing in a SLW and maybe a couple others, but nothing big to brag about except Monsanto. And uh, the afternoons, the last couple of days, have actually been quite boring. So we will try to send out another free pick later this week. Uh, if not, we'll make it up and do two next week. But our apologies for that video not working. So have a great night and we'll talk to you later.